Hello, beautiful souls. Be still and know I am God. Connect with that, the dimension of being inside you, with your soul, with your consciousness. And know I am God. Hello, bird. I am bird. <laughs> uh, In this video, we're going to talk about uh, the, paradigm, the paradigm shift, the divine consciousness, the fifth dimension, and uh, what is going on on this uh, moment on the planet. And uh, yeah, can you feel it, guys? The shift, everything is changing so rapidly fast. Millions of people are waking up all around the world. They're waking up and they're finding their, their way back to wholeness, back to divinity. And, uh, oh my god, guys, the energies that are uh, running uh, this place now are super powerful, you know. As the time progresses, more and more powerful energies are gonna inhabit our bodies, are gonna inhabit our bodies and the shift is gonna be even, even more felt to everybody. But can you feel it, guys? Can you feel it? Are you in your ascension process? Has your spiritual awakening uh, been triggered? Oh my god, the new world, guys, the unimaginable. Fifth dimension, you can imagine the fifth dimension. Imagination is uh, a mind thing, it's, it is happening in the fourth dimension. You can imagine the fifth. The fifth uh, is, is not from this uh, matrix, it's the collapse of the two worlds. You know, we are the bridge. Every people that ascends to to the fifth uh, dimension. Some people call it Samadhi, some people call it uh, Transcendent Dimension of Consciousness, like the great Eckhart Tolle. A uh, fifth dimension. It's uh, the uh, words, thoughts that are pointing to the Transcendent. And uh, can you feel it, guys? When you, when you transcend, then you become a bridge that uh, you communicate with the third dimensional world. Actually, it's, it's on every one of us that uh, is ascending uh, into the fifth dimension, into the new world, into the new earth, is uh, here to communicate with the 3D world. It's actually here to transmute and change this world by transmuting and changing himself. That's where all your power lies. So if you had uh, a very, a very tough uh, childhood, a very tough, a very hard life, a very painful life, a life full of suffering since the early uh, years of your childhood. Uh, trust the timing of your life, guys. Trust the timing of your life. As above, so below. As above, so below. Trust the timing of your life. Yeah, if you, the brighter your light, the brighter the light of your consciousness, the brighter the light of your soul, the more deep into hell and earth you're gonna be planted. You're gonna be planted inside the darkness. And uh, when you are ready, you're gonna wake up from the depth of hell, from the depth of darkness, and you're gonna shine bright and pull everybody that goes there, shake everybody that goes there to return back to the source, you know. Uh, there's a purpose for everything, there's no coincidences, no luck. <laughs> there's divine order, divine activity and purpose in everything. Nothing is a coincidence, guys. From a high level of consciousness, you can, uh, uh, you can see a bigger uh, spectrum of the truth and you can see that. Taking a fifth uh, dimensional perspective over things, you realize that uh, there are no coincidences, uh, there are no accidents. Everything is happening uh, with divine order for a purpose. Past, present and future are, are all happening at the, the same time and they are all connected. Okay, who did you meet in that experience that you should have not met otherwise? What did you interact with? Uh, pay attention, get in the present moment, observe. 
observe, and this is uh, the greater truth, you know. This perception of reality is so wide, it, it's actually bigger than this uh, physical matrix right here, it's actually bigger than this. You know, you are out of uh, uh, linear time, um, uh, uh, your perception is so wide open because you see through the eyes of oneness, you, you see through the eyes of death, because the only way to glimpse the truth is death. Okay, your persona has to die, your ego has to die, uh, and you begin to glimpse the oneness, the unity consciousness, and uh, with uh, the grace of the Holy Spirit, you, you're gonna be able, uh, step by step, the truth is gonna be revealed to you, uh, in divine order, with higher intelligence, from a higher level of consciousness, because the divine consciousness, which includes the uh, whole God, God, you can say God consciousness, divine consciousness, um, it is uh, infinite intelligence, guys. <laughs> when you experience the divine consciousness within you, it is uh, the moment uh, where uh, uh, you realize that uh, the thoughts of the human brain are very limited intelligence. We have so much more, guys. There is so much more inside us because this new dimension of consciousness, the fifth dimension of consciousness, is not thoughts, it's above thoughts, guys. It's higher intelligence. And uh, it's, it is higher intelligence. The, the path is vibrational. You travel into the dark void in a not knowing mind, and the path reveals itself as you move. You are full on intuition, you are following your heart impulses, and you, you are in a not thinking mind, in the unknown. It's, uh, it's, um, you're always in the present moment, where past, present, and future are happening at the same time. Uh, and, uh, yeah, it's, uh, oh my God, this world, guys, it's coming. I don't know if you can feel the shift. There's a great shift of humanity going through a great change. So whatever you are going through, it's gonna make sense later on. Keep going through. The hardest battles are given uh, to the toughest warriors. The brightest lights are deep rooted inside the darkness, guys. I'm sharing you from first hand. Uh, from my early childhood, I was experiencing uh, deep suffering in my body. I had diabetes since uh, I was a little child. Then celiac disease, it was a hell on earth from my early child. Uh, I experienced the darkness of this world, the pain of the humanity, the separation from source. Um, uh, until uh, 28 years old, where my life has become a complete nightmare. I was dying. I was dying, depressed, uh, you know, all this uh, overthinking, stress, uh, nightmares, uh, demons inside me. I got demons from uh, a relationship I had. Uh, I was dying, literally dying. And suddenly my spiritual awakening got triggered, 11-11-2019. And that is the day where the, the turn of the tides bega began. That was the day of the turn of the tides. Uh, for the greater comeback, uh, you know, in three years from deep hell on earth, I had three near-death experiences. Uh, from deep hell on earth, deep, deep down. Now, heaven on earth, guys, three years. Everything is possible when God makes a uh, way for you. Everything is possible. It will all make sense in the end. Keep, keep going, especially if you are a light worker, if you are a warrior of God, you are gonna be deep inside the darkness. You are planted. You are planted in there, you guys. You are planted. You are there for a purpose. Nothing is coincidence. All you have to do is to remember your wholeness, to remember your divinity. Get back, guys. Get back. It's your awakening call. Remember, remember your divinity. And uh, can you feel the shift? If you can feel the shift, comment down below. Comment down below. If you can feel it. If you can feel this shift. It's a massive shift of consciousness happening. You know, we that we have ascended into the fifth dimension, we already have gone through uh, the purging and the cleansing of our other side. So, uh, we got assigned the way for you. And, uh, oh my God, 
it's gonna be a little bit uncomfortable there are gonna be a lot of disturbances you are gonna have to face your darkness to transmit your darkness to light your shadow side but uh, it's gonna be like you are dying your brain is gonna change from linear time to multi-dimensional you're gonna get uh, you're gonna be getting DNA upgrades you know your whole body is gonna be changing uh, you are changing in all levels and uh, guys everything that you are going through is gonna be worth it because the new world is literally heaven on earth heaven on earth you have to experience it it's um, uh, the unimaginable you can't imagine that you can only be found from within by connecting with the knower in you with your intuition by reconnecting with uh, your soul by remembering your wholeness by paying attention with your mind to the observer of the thinking mind to that part of you that is aware that you are thinking and feeling okay that's the key just do it just do it just do it search but you have to think for yourself you have to connect back from within through your intuition okay so with that, that being said we're gonna end this transmission for now uh, express gratitude guys gratitude is the greatest hack of the matrix express gratitude and get on board for the for the most amazing human part of the human experience that uh, we're gonna be traveling soon in this time dimension get ready you guys because what's coming you can't believe it guys it's gonna get so 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 full this life is gonna be so so full embrace everything and rise and uh, with that being said i'm gonna remind you that uh, there are uh, tons of facility masters tons of uh, old souls at this moment uh, on uh, the planet <laughs> and more and more and more high vibrational uh, beings are right during uh, this time dimension and the next years guys are gonna be so 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 are good uh, things are gonna get so 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 amazing it's gonna be the fullness so with that being said peace